Now, as you can see, I got a decent amount of mustard here in the bowl. And, uh, Wayne, how about you tell them what the next ingredient should be? Alright, next ingredient is this little guy right here. You might be wondering what this is. This is an energy shot, alright, from your local, uh, Quick mark. It just adds a little kick, you know. Adds a little kick because you know you're gonna be eating the leftovers in the morning, and yeah. it gets you right, right into school, right into work, wherever you're going. Perfect. Perfect. Just add the whole shot. It'll give you that extra kick that you need. Now you want to make sure that it's nice and whisked. Spin it around. Just make sure it's all evenly spread out. A good mixture. Now I've been getting a lot of fan mail from you guys saying that you like when I do my whisk tricks. So I'm going to do a few of them for you today. I'll start with the classic, the front flip, like that. And then here's a new one I came up with. It's called, I call it the bounce. It goes like this. Uh, get a, get. You'll, you'll get them next time. Okay. Okay, so our secret ingredient frozen pizza rolls, all right? Now this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna add about... Oh, yeah, get the leftover. Pretty make sure they... Oh. There we go. All right, we're gonna add about half of these right now. Perfect. And uh, gonna go ahead and uh, mix those in there. And we're gonna actually go ahead and start getting ready to bake this. Uh, can you grab the pan for me, Jess? Oh, of course. Right, now, as you can see, we have a 9 by 13 inch yeah. baking pan right here, like a cake pan. We're just going to go ahead and just pour it into the pan. Pour the mixture right in there. Directly, directly into that pan. You want to make sure you get all those beans. All right. Now that's all out of the bowl and into our pan. All right, that looks about right. It does. Now it's all in the pan, and let me tell you, Jesse, this dish looks great. I'll tell you what, we should have one of those cooking shows. <laughs> You're right on that one. <laughs> all right, Jesse, why don't you go ahead and grab the rest of those pizza rolls, layer them on top real nice. I'm going to grab our last secret ingredient before we bake. Okay. All right, I'm back with our last and final secret ingredient before we bake, and it's a crazy one, let me tell you. And it really just adds that sweet kick that you need for a dish like this. It's chocolate frosting. Mm -hmm. Now let me tell you what, you're just going to go ahead, get it, and you, you really want to try and layer it on the dish. Like, nice and evenly, because you, you don't want to miss any spots, because this is probably the best part of yeah. the entire oh, dish. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You just, just gotta, you can see that? Just sometimes you just gotta... Alrighty folks, now that chocolate is, is really nice and spread out in there, and it's that really is. gonna add a lot of good flavor. Now, um, we're gonna take a quick commercial break uh, to hear a word from our sponsors, and while you're gone, we're gonna go ahead and bake this bad boy for eight to 10 minutes at 350 degrees, and when you get back, we're gonna dig in. That we are. How many times has this happened to you? You're just trying to put a straw in a drink and things go wrong. Well, worry no more. Now you can turn a boring old situation like this into this with new Slug and Slurp a Mug. It's totally slurpable. It's totally sluggable. And let me tell you, it's totally fun. Slug and Slurp a Mug. You can slug it, slurp it, and it's also a mug. You can get your very own Slug and Slurp Mug for only $24.95 plus shipping and handling by calling 1-800-555-4827. Call today! Alright guys, welcome back to Classic Cooking. As you just saw, our dish is now done, and now... Wayne, I think it's time to dig in. I agree, Jesse. Let's go right head first and dive into this thing. I'm so excited. I'll tell you that much. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. 